it's another lazy review a one punch man and why not do a lazy review i mean everybody seems to already watch one punch man except me well anyway so we're talking one punch man episode one and my first thoughts of this episode and overall what i'm getting into is wow the animation looks beautiful and the animation reminds me a lot of Gurren Lagan. That's right, Gurren Lagan, one of my favorite animes of all time. Now, I don't, I, I didn't remember all the names, well, I didn't remember any of the names, so I'm just gonna reference the bald guy to the bald guy. <laughs> and it's kind of funny how it starts off with him having hair and how he got into the super, like superhero, being a superhero isn't a job or anything like that. It's a hobby to him, and I, I actually really like that. It's just a hobby to him. He's going through the motions. And when going into the series, I was like, what the hell is One Punch Man? He beats people with one punch? I thought that's basically, he's kind of weak. In my mind, when people were telling me that, I thought he was kind of weak. But it's the complete opposite. He is so overpowered, so strong, that it only takes him literally one punch to defeat an opponent. So he doesn't have like an opponent he can go up against that he can use multiple combos or anything like that because he just defeats everybody with one punch. I thought the humor in there here was definitely a, uh, how would you say it? It's definitely not an all out comedy or anything like that. It's more like a dramatic kind of humor, a sense of dry humor. Um, I know there's a word for it, but I feel like the, the humor works really well, especially with this character. He kind of remind me of uh, Oga from Beezle, Beezlebub, but it, it was really great to see how, how he just really got into the superhero thing and how he, his hair fell apart because we haven't had an animated character that had his bald headed unless you talk to Kaku, uh, Kaku from Bleach, but he's not the main guy. This is the main guy. And I actually really like him. I, th I think his eyes are what tells you about his character more than any of his design. It's a simple design. He has a bald head. Sometimes he looks hilarious when he, his eyes are like, he looks like kind of like, not a stick figure, but like an egg. He looks like an egg, all right? He looks like Humpty Dumpty. But what I really took away from this episode was, okay, the villain's <laughs> really weird. I mean, at one point, he tears an eye off of, of half crab, half man, 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 big. No, it's a half crab looking dude. And that's how, that was his first opponent ever. And he tears the eye off that. I mean, it's pretty brutal. And the little dream sweet sequence that he had battling all these, uh, this kind of like alien race or whatever, or this underground society that came up to take over Earth and everything, which actually happens, but it's not what he dreamt of. I thought that was really greatly done. The the action, the animation. Er, th this anime so far has given me a great first impression. I think uh, the music is not too in your face. I think the opening and ending are fine. I didn't really, I didn't really care for the music, honestly. Uh, but what it does have going for it is a character who's definitely it's a definitely unique kind of story where. This guy is just so overpowered. So you got to just think of Madara, right? You got to think Kishimoto saying, Madara is so overpowered. How the hell do, do they defeat him? And this is the complete opposite. Like, this guy is so overpowered. He's looking for an opponent to fight. So that's what I liked about this so far, this first episode in the series. And I can't wait to see what other characters we meet along the way. If this guy ever grows hair. <laughs> And just overall, if he will meet that opponent that he's waiting for. So first impressions, great start for One Punch Man. Getting ready for episode two until I catch up. And then I will do, I want to do just a whole podcast of not only One Punch Man, but all the new series I've seen so far. That includes Beautiful Bones, Dragon Ball Super, and all that. So thank you guys for listening. I am Dan Mankin. And soon, subscribe if you like these lazy reviews, because I like these lazy reviews. I'm so comfortable right now. And comment below and let me know your guys' thoughts on that first episode of One Punch Man. Don't spoil it for me, because I'm going on to episode two as we speak. So bye, guys. Where's the, where's the